Here with Tom Blair after a great really one all draw with having a Waterloo reel, both teams really going at it. Um, what's your perspective from it? How do you find it? Uh, I think it was a good game for the neutral, definitely. Um, from our point of view, we're obviously disappointed in the changing room after the game. You know, they went down to 10 men for 30 minutes or so, so we're disappointed not to, to come away with a win, but they made it difficult for us when they had 10 men. They got behind the ball and you know, defended really well, to be fair to them, but I think any team would be disappointed not to get that goal with 10 men. Um, but yeah, obviously, like, disappointed, but we've got to take the positive four points from six over a tough weekend, two games in three days. Um, got some sore bodies in the camp today, but um, like I said, if you'd have said four points before the weekend, we would have definitely taken that. I spoke to Jimmy earlier and we saw a big change in the second half, really came out all guns blazing. What did he say to you in the, in the dressing room? Because we heard from his point of view, but interested to hear from the players too. Yeah, I mean, he just said we need to be better. We were, we were poor in the first half. Yeah. Um, credit to them, they did make it hard for us. They pressed with intensity, they were aggressive all over the pitch, they were tight. Um, but we needed to find the errors, which you know they were lacking in numbers. And like I said, like you said, the tempo was poor. Um, and I think first ten minutes of the first half, we did uh, second half. Sorry, we did that, um, which is why we scored the goal so quickly. Um, but then I think when we went, when they went to ten men, we we did drop again in tempo, uh, which suited them because they were just able to shuffle side to side and stop us, you know, getting getting into areas where we wanted to. But um, but yeah, I think it was just the tempo was poor. But I think. We eradicated that second half. You're a few weeks now into your, your time at AFC Tottenham. How have you found it compared to the previous clubs you've been at? Yeah, I'm really enjoying it. Um, honestly, it doesn't feel like a step down no. um, from where I was previously at, at Dorking. You know, the facilities we have at Tottenham, the players, the staff, everything is set up for us to you know get get promoted out of this league, which is obviously our one goal. Um, so yeah, I'm really enjoying it. The, the players are great. The gaffer is good. Obviously, we've got. The likes of James Beatty and Charlie Austin, which you know is great for the lads, experience-wise. Um, and you know we should be there or thereabouts, hopefully, if we do everything right come the end of the season. Yeah. And having a Waterloo as well, your ex-club. Um, yeah. How have you found it coming back here? Can we read anything into the uh, the celebration yeah. at all? Uh, I think it was just to be fair, getting some stick when I went down when I got elbowed in the nose in the first three seconds, which was a straight red. Um, but you know, to be fair, the lino just didn't see it. But yeah, I got some stick. On the floor when I was there, but you know it's, it's natural. I think when you come to any old club, you're going to get a bit of, a bit of stick. But um, I think it's just a friendly banner. I've, I've seen a few fans after the game and uh, had some laughs with them. So um, yeah, nothing really to read into it. I think emotions sometimes yeah. take over when you score. Yeah. So no hard feelings. Really, oh no, you? not at all. I enjoyed my time here. Um, left on good terms, and I wish them all the best. Hopefully, you know, you'd like to think that we be both teams will be right up there come the end of the season. So you know, best of luck to them. Yeah. I was saying to Jimmy as well earlier, we've had a, a difficult run of games really on paper. You look at the Walton, Hersham, Hungerford, yeah. even having a Waterloo ball expected to be up there. Uh, but now we look forward to the FA Cup uh, against Westbury United. A different kind of affair. Yeah. Uh, what are you hoping for? I think just keep keep going, you know, play the next game. That's all we've got to do, not get too ahead of ourselves. Like you said, when we got the fixtures, when they came out, we thought that's going to be a tough run. And, you know, to take the points that we have from them so far is obviously positive, but we can't stop. We've got to keep going. Be ruthless, you know. Westbury will be hard to break down. Probably a similar like second half today. That, you know they'll get back in their shape and, and make it hard for us. So we've got to find ways to you know get around them and, uh, and get the victory. Um, but yeah, you know we're looking forward to it. Like I said, next game as it comes really. Cheers for your time. Sir. No problem. Thank you.